always trying to find good places to ride our e-mountain bikes and um, it's really hard to to tell where where's the best place where's the, where's the best food where's the best restaurant where's the best trails where is um, what's a good area and that's um, how we came up with that uh, trail explorer idea and we will have uh, a couple of stops and our first one is in uh, England um, I'm on my way to Brendan Fairclaw to explore his trails in his backyard and I'm sure he's going to show us some some of his secret spots and of course some of the nicer pubs in this area We're here in the UK, um, showing Holger some of my local trails. We've got a little bike park to show him today. We've got some uh, off-piste, naughty trails to show him. I spend most of my time on, but I think the, the idea is just to show him around, give him an idea of what uh, my day-to-day -day, uh, riding is, and, uh, and rip his legs off on the e-bike. We're here at Rogate Bike Park. I grew up at this place, so it's got bigger and bigger over time. Super cool for learning on, for building up your skills. So uh, on that note, I thought I'd bring Holger here to build his skills up, ready for tomorrow's uh, rut track. But uh, yeah, we're here and uh, it's pretty exciting to show him around. So Holger, this is uh, actually a triple. There's a landing right there. Oh, I didn't but see I, um, that as a landing. <laughs> I wouldn't wouldn't suggest it for uh, the e-bike. I know what you mean. <laughs> so I gotta take it easy and hit that one. Yeah. So yesterday uh, we showed Holger the local bike park. I mean, it's not your traditional. Alps uh, style ski lifts and five minute downhill runs but having the e-bike there makes it even cooler because you can just do lap after lap after lap after lap and you don't have to don't have to uh, worry about getting to the top yeah it's pretty pretty cool to show Holger that and we had, we had good dirt and uh, good times and then today obviously we've got uh, weather is a bit comsy comsa and uh, it's gonna be a bit more of a handful, I think, for Holger to deal with these steep tracks that we've got. So uh, we'll see how the old fella copes. What? I really fell in love with England. This is my first time. All the pubs we went in had brilliant beers, really good food. The only thing that really makes me crazy is the driving on the wrong side of the road.
riding this place with your e-bike is so much fun. You, you can actually just hammer through the mud all the way up. You can try to pass your buddy. Um, like yesterday when I was riding with Brendan and he was trying to pass me on the other on the other little single track there. It makes your mountain bike day so much more enjoyable. such a great uh, trail and bike community and everybody hangs out in a coffee or bike shop and then they just go out for rides and they go riding before work like really early in the morning or they do night rides are sometimes are really muddy and loose so on a regular bike you would really be exhausted after one or two runs and on the e-bike you just go and 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 go till the battery is over but then you will find a pub for sure and have a pint You need a beer now. True that. You've been working harder. Oh, you had two at lunch, eh? You won't see anything on the GoPro because Brandon was gone. I was on my own in the forest. Somewhere here in the Sherwood Forest. Was it fun though? It was fun, yeah. I saw big jumps coming up to my <laughs> front wheel, but it was fun in the end. <laughs>